Previously on Tamriel Tuesdays. Many years ago, my daughter was <sighs> by bandits who came to our village. I'm you and me sorry. both, buddy. I, I need we'll have to, to after this episode's <laughs> over, we're pouring the one out for Nels. Yeah, Nels the Naughty. To Nels. Nels the Naughty. Uh, we'll miss you, buddy. And now... Welcome back to Tamriel Tuesdays. I am Tenava. And this is Ochiva. 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 Hi, Ochiva. Hello, grandson. <laughs> Greetings, one. Their son in law? <laughs> Whatever. Shampoo. Uh, uh, cologne. Cologne, cologne yeah. from Ronda. One that has been sanctioned by the Black Hand itself. Son in law. Actually, she sounds a bit like Marge Simpson. Holy. Holy. <laughs> Jinx. <laughs> okay, contract. Let's do it. Do you recall the name? Woohoo. Adamus Philida. The Imperial this is a fun one. Legion Best. It's AKA a pain in the Sith ass. In the yeah. <laughs> Think you're up to the Sithis. task. It kind of reminds this one, like as you'll see, it kind of reminds me of like some of the more annoying Colossus in Shadow the Colossus. Oh yeah, like we're just like it's like super annoying time based. Like just have to do like everything just right, and you know what to do, but like it just trying to make it fucking happen. Like getting your fingers and like everything that work. Yeah. Um, speaking of honor. speaking of which. <laughs> What? It's pertinent to our upcoming Oh, quest. fingers. Yes. Adamus Philida has spent his entire career investigating the Dark Brotherhood, the interrupting Brotherhood. our contracts, killing our family members. We tried to eliminate Philida, of course, but failed. Try telling yourself that her nostrils are her eyes. He's a powerful man. Oh, and neat. Was <laughs> by kind of cute. <laughs> Now the legion Why are big red eyebrows <laughs> move bul- around. moving around and bulging? Philida must not be allowed such a victory. His destiny oh, that's is so trippy. <laughs> darker. I think our chief is cute. In, in the city watch barracks, an honored guest of the soldiers there. He is in fact more vulnerable than ever. Listen well, my child. The Black Hand has sanctioned the Rose of Sithis. It is an enchanted arrow that will kill Philida instantly. As long as the arrow hits Philida, he will die. But it cannot pierce armor. Shoot while Philida is armored, and the Rose will be wasted. Important. Travel to it's too bad that you can't like just shoot him in the face <laughs> when he has his armor on. When he yeah. Moves that blasted legion armor and then let fly the rose of Sithis. Kill Philida in any way, rose or not, and the contract is complete. But to receive a bonus, you must go beyond murder. You must send a message. Once Philida is dead, sever his finger. The one that bears uh, an Imperial finger. Legion signet ring. Deposit this finger in the desk of Philida's successor, in his office in the prison barracks in the Imperial City. Do this, and the bonus is yours. All right. <gasps> Don't you hate it when your shadow is like all pixelated like that? Like, God. isn't that the worst? Like three times a day, I notice it. Adamus Philida will find no rest in retirement. No. His soul will endure a <laughs> eternal suffering known only to those who have angered Sithis. I do like that the uh, in the Elder Scrolls mythos there is no real the evidence for Sithis, which makes him extra, extra creepy. Yeah. Like, it's probably just nothing. It fills my heart. You know, but it might I be. And, like, what if, like, the Dark Brotherhood were right? <laughs> yeah, it is the real religion. <laughs> But I mean, the thing is, it's like there's like tangible evidence for the other religions. Like yeah. If you worship Daedra, you can you can fucking see them. Yeah, and you can meet them. You can meet them. Whereas the Nine is that you can sort of feel enhanced by them. Yeah, like you, you feel get, the like, effects of the Nine, but you don't see them or really understand them. So it's a little amorphous. But with Sithis, there's like these are maybe the most devoted, and there's no proof. Yeah. 
But I think it's like the fact that the night mother, the other person they worship, is real. Like almost gives more credence to Sith as being real. It's like, yeah. But I mean, she's just like a. Oh, I don't want to. Yeah, no, stay too much. Yeah. <laughs> the roles will only work if Philida is unarmored. So, when would a soldier not wear his armor? How does he see? My armor off to sleep <laughs> through his nostrils. Him. Oh, cute! Yeah, oh, cute! <laughs> Denava! Nords are highly resistant to frost attacks, and they. They never. I'm the Nava schemer! Schemer! Oh, so cute, so cute, my little buddy. Schemer. Seeing you. Oh, she's oh, here. Oh, hello. Sister, it warms my heart to see you. The Rose of Sithis? Such an honor! Just make sure your markmanship is up to the task. If you miss the target, the enchantment will be wasted. Hmm. She's they like, uh, <laughs> you still need to see true. fucking Soul Taker. I know. Uh, okay. But like, the guy on Soul Taker with the big face, that's her. Oh, okay. Um, don't get me wrong. That magic arrow sounds nice and all, but it seems to me like you don't even need to use it to get the bonus. As long as you cut off his finger and leave it in that desk, you'll get your bonus. Sounds to me like you can kill the old son. I've only ever like killed him with the arrow, so and it's always a huge armor? pain. Yeah. You think that Imperial Legion scrap I wonder if this is put in to say, like, you know, it's like, okay, it's a pain in the ass. Like, if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. Happy hunting, Just leave the finger sister. in the desk. Yeah. Which is, you know, a good way to, like, in quest design, like, you're a, you, at this time, point, you would be accustomed to asking your fellow assassins. Yeah, and it's it, not be like, like... You know, it's like, don't sweat it. If it doesn't happen, don't sweat it. And it's not like, you know, a Rockstar game. And, you know, like, I love, I love some Rockstar games just as much as, you know, the next guy. But, like, man, Rockstar games love a fail state if you don't do it precisely, exactly to how they want you to do it. What, you used your left foot to step there, just there? Hello, dear yeah, it's like, sister. fail, fail, restart checkpoint. Oh, you're being sent to kill Philida. I hope the Rose of Sithis pierces his heart and sends his soul screaming Maybe into the, the void. Maybe the void is a really nice place. Yeah. Have they considered it? Good luck, sister. I don't think so. I don't think I they, hope they're I really help. critical thinkers. Philida may be retired, but he'll likely have a bodyguard. Probably a member of the Leowin City Watch. You may have to dispose of him as well. Huh. It's interesting that, like, uh, from... Like working at the city watch in the wait, did you want to ask the cat guy? He doesn't ever tell you. Oh, I but I wonder if this is like one of the ones where he starts to come around. You again? Oh no, I no, 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 never mind. And Do you want to buy some lockpicks? Sure. You again? Uh, yeah. I don't I have a lockpick. Um, Oop, not so. Bleep, 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 bleep. You ripped me off blind. Uh, yeah. I'm, I don't know. I hope they're kind of weighty. With yeah, they are. I mean, unless we had some uh, stuff that, yeah, we can't. How how is Umber doing, by the way? Uh, Let's check out. Because we ninety five. Ninety five. Good. And good. we can't. Good. Good. So I guess we could. Repair the shield isn't enchanted, but everything else is enchanted, so we can't repair it. Oh, okay. But, I mean, it seems like everything's in, in pretty fine repair. You know, like, at some point, we had to, like, head over to Rock Milk. Uh, take out Rock... So, okay, so... <laughs> people who don't know, Rock Milk Cave is a dungeon in this game where... It's, like, one of the few dungeons where they have, like, a lot of AI stuff going on, where it's, like, a... Bandits versus bandits war going on every two weeks. The Marauders there. versus the Black Bows. Yeah, that, so, does that seem right? Okay, two yeah. different bandit gangs um, at war in this one dungeon, and you can sort of sneak through and take out whoever's left. Like they'll fight each other, and the fight could go either way. But you, as a third party, can just pick off the stragglers, and then you like go and harvest pick their har equipment and sell it. And then also, if you want to build up your armor or stat, you can just repair all their damaged armor. Yeah. So it's like really like right now. So like how Oblivion works with his armor system too is it's um, level based. 
So you'll, uh, like, we're really low level right now. Let's see, we're level four. So, oh, like, Jesus. we're just going to be having, like, there would just be, like, iron armor. Maybe, like, at level five, they start having steel armor. At level... 10, they start having dwarven armor. 15, they start having... You know, at 20, uh, Daedra armor. Yeah, and it's 20, it's like sort of the soft cap. Yeah. Where, like, they'll start having the best stuff. But, um... Yeah, right now, it's not really worth it because we're so low level. Yeah. Like, their stuff just is gonna suck. But, like, I remember Joe, like, he would go there and just grind out stuff. So, like, Daedra daggers would be, like, the best bang for... You're, yeah, it because would, they would be really lightweight, and they would sell for the max yeah. amount that anybody could buy them for. Yeah. So you just go load up on like a bunch of Daedra daggers. Let's see. Okay, so, and like you, you need a boatload of money to buy all of the special properties in all of the cities, and, and then upgrade those properties. Yeah. So yeah, like you can have houses. There's like player housing in Oblivion. Um, so like the nice houses are like Anvil and Skingrad. Yeah. The other houses aren't very nice, but... I think... They're like, some of them are okay, but, like, they're not very memorable for us, personally. Yeah. Okay. So, so, lore catch-up, for people who don't know. So, at some point earlier on, we had... We were told about Adamus Philida, who was a, uh, like, captain in the Imperial Watch... And we in were just, the Imperial City. In the Imperial City. And we were warned about him as one of the few people who was, like, really bent out of shape about the Dark Brotherhood, whose, like, goal in life was to take them down. Right. Uh, and we were warned about killing, uh, it was, I think, the elf guy in the Imperial City. Um, because if we killed him blatantly out in the open... It would Adamus attract the ire of Adamus Philida. So now, like, you know, four quests later... Uh, he's uh, retired, and he's now part of this, uh, like, kept on as an honorary member of the Leowin City Watch. It's kind of a lesser city. It's essentially his retirement. Like, it's a, it's a cush job out in the boonies where he can just, like, live out the rest of his days. And he has a successor back in uh, the Imperial City who the Dark Brotherhood is worried will take up his... Mantle. Mantle of trying to take down the Dark Brotherhood. So where our goal is to kill Adamus Philida as a message to send to that new uh, guy who took his place. And then not only that, cut off his fing- Adamus Philida's finger to put in the new guy's desk yep. so that he never he knows never to question or mess with the Dark Brotherhood. Yep. So uh, let's go talk to Philida. Where are you going? Inside here. It's bringing me here. Oh, really? I don't remember. Do we have a contact here, or maybe just telling us where she is? Good morning. Maybe the be- oh, Bugak his bodyguards here. There he is. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. So we just need to wait until he takes off his armor, which we will find out that he only does to go for his daily swim in the moat. Yeah. Which. Historically, really gross. Yeah. Really, really, Ready really gross. Fight. The stagnant, like, There's sewer water out of the castle. Of it's like... Well, you found... I mean, that would kill him. <laughs> that would kill him, like, you know, more thoroughly than Black we possibly could. I understand that Sadrasa is still trying to... What is your citizen? Right, to Do we know each other? There's something familiar about you, but I just can't place it. Yes, well, I'm a very busy man, enjoying my retirement, don't you know? So why don't you just go away? It's so funny that, like, in the Dark Brotherhood, sometimes, like, I'll think of, like, Adamus Builder, oh, he's a, such a jerk, what a jerk, you know? Uh, but, like, no, like, he's, he's like, the most honorable... Yeah, like, trying to stop this, this evil organization that you're part of. There's no problem, is there? The old man. Ha. He's easy to protect. Every day's the same. He visits the Coast Guard station, goes for a swim, <laughs> and puts himself in harm's way. Hmm. Okay. 
All right. Well, he's told us all that he he will about Adamus Philida. I know. I just want to make him like me. <laughs> make him hate you. I can't. Good. Yes. Whatever. It's not important. Goodbye. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Well, maybe I'll. Ooh. Do we want to take out the bodyguard? It, let's let's leave him alive. He's he's not our concern. All right. So we'll just go and hang out by the moat, I guess. Yeah. For like twenty four hours. Um. Let's see. I think it was the moat that. Did I, he give you a time for when he swam? No. I didn't. Yeah. I think it's in the evening. Is it or early? the early evening, I think maybe. And then we need like a real sneaky spot to hit him from a distance because the bodyguard's gonna be watching him swim. All right, let's go for like eight hours. I might stop it a little early. Yeah, Joe and I, before we started recording Oblivion today, uh, we're trying to remember like what the next quest was and we ended up remembering. Yep. What's this one? Yep. That's just how cool we are. It's like high five. <laughs> we have two different folding <laughs> guys. They can agree. Tenava. Tenava. Dodgy. Hail. I'm dodgy. Dodgy. Want to I'm see me lick my butt? <laughs> 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 that would never also, fun. courage to carry, uh, or not courage, uh, um, fucking the the um, triumph, the comedy dog. Yeah, this is a, yeah, it's actually pretty funny. Oh my god, deep in the skies. Uh, yeah, for me to poop on. <laughs> oh, there he is. Okay, okay, uh, save it. Where's his bodyguard? I didn't even see him. With that arrow. Flower the rose of Sithis. Okay, R take the shot. Insta kill. Alright. <laughs> okay, hopefully we don't have a bounty. Adamus Felata is dead. I may return now to the sanctuary for my reward. If I want to receive a bonus, however, there is one more task I must complete. Philida wears an Imperial Legion ring. I should take his finger, with the ring still attached, and put it in the desk of Philida's Imperial Legion successor in his office in the Imperial City. Take the shot! Okay, how are we doing bounty wise? 40. Shit. Uh, okay, let's, um. Too bad we're not a member of the Thieves Guild, we could just pay off the bounty. Um, eh, might as well take that, so... Actually, we can pay off the bounty now. They'll just take us in, and we won't have to go to prison if we can pay off the... I've acquired the seven finger, yeah, okay. Did he actually lose a finger, I wonder? Oh, the model? I'm sure not. Make it down, bruh. Bruh. Let's just drag him out of the pond and take a look. Ah, uh, that looks... he looked full-fingered there. That's why they called him Full Fingered Adamus. Adamus. No, nothing. Can't pull him out. The bodyguard still doesn't see it. He's pretty ripped for an old guy. Or maybe that just like he's just airbrushed. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think he's missing a finger. The bodyguard looks back right now. <laughs> uh, um, uh, sir, I'll just look the other way. <laughs> so, you, should we go? You just want to pay it off here? Yeah, let's just fucking pay it off. Unless they like, search our shit. It's Whoa! All over, hey, buddy. Oh Most my god. Pego. That's too bad. Okay. Here's the procedure. We go to the castle. Oh, we're gonna Please. lose some. Uh, it seems like we had like some stolen skooma or something. Oh, they Where took our skooma. Make it quick. I think he's from the Mage's Guild. 
Maybe? Stop or it. it seems like maybe like Knights of the Nine because like- Oh, you are correct. You are correct. Hey, one day we're gonna be your boss. Do we still have the finger? They're like, Jesus Christ, that's heft. Put a finger on this woman. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Um, let's see. Well, um, let's go uh, plant a finger. Bro, do you even plant fingers? Bro, I plant fingers. I just don't... <laughs> I don't even know what... The Imperial City Arena attracts gladiators and gamblers from all over Cyrodiil. An apprentice of acrobatics. Um, Loading area. Yeah, I would like to, you know, do like the Thieves Guild quest line. I'd like to do the Arena quest line. I'd like to do some Daedra. Okay. All right. Denava. Denava. Glad we bought some lockpicks. I think maybe we have a key. I took a bunch of keys from him. Oh, maybe. Crash fingers. They are cross. <laughs> we only have one of them. We only have one. We only have one finger. Oh, there we go. But we're trespassing, so watch out. I always do. Oh, there is the, his desk. Nice. Real nice. Decent <laughs> finger. Uh, I have placed the finger of Adamus Philida in the desk of his successor in his office in the Imperial City. I should now return to Ochiva and claim my reward and bonus. It would be cool if you could just hang around to watch the guy find the finger. Yeah. It's like, whoa, hi, to hide, just with what? Ooh. Sell that stuff. It made like cartoony Scooby Doo sound effects. Zoinks? <laughs> <laughs> Joe, I need to know your your hot take on a pup named Scooby Doo. Um, I like that show. I mean, it's, it was on when I was a kid. Um, like I, you know, I think it's perfectly watchable, but not even though I think it was maybe done better than the original classic Scooby Doo. It's not as charming. Yeah. Or as timeless. Greetings. It's me. Can you? I can eat for a day. Thank Have you, a coin, beggar. Or Patrick Stewart. Blessings no, we already saw Patrick Stewart die. Oh. But maybe he faked his death so he could be a hobo here in Chicken Hall. Yeah, it's possible. Seems very Elder Scrolls-esque for a character to do that. And, you know, because um, Patrick Stewart's a trained theater actor, he could really pull it off. I mean, um, Uriel, Uriel Septim the Seventh. Uh, why? I, oh, okay, I see. She's in the training hall. Training hall. Adamas Philida is dead. I could feel my heart swell with the Night Mother's love the moment that Imperial Pig issued his last breath. You have done a great service to the Dark Brotherhood today, Assassin. Your reward is well earned. You also managed to leave Philida's severed finger as a warning to his successor. Well done. Your bonus, 500 additional gold coins, is well earned. Go now, get some rest. Sithis knows you've earned it. When you're ready for another contract, you need only ask. Yeah, well, um, phew. Yeah, we've just, uh, done another hit for this evil organization. Get some help with that. 
Be like a scene from Ghost. Uh. <laughs> 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 like I like that when you like knock her off balance, it, you could see the arrow bounce off the wall. <laughs> yeah. If you just wanted to collect her arrows. Oh, I never buy arrows. <laughs> I just wait for other people to use them and then I steal them. Well, as we've completed the mission, I think we will safely see you next, next time. time. Shoot. Take the shot. Do it. <laughs> Do it now. Kill me. <laughs> no. Yes. <laughs>